we drove down to the financial district and uh, pull over to park and open the door and there's a bird and there's another bird and another bird. Before I knew it, I was running all over the, the sidewalks picking up birds and uh, changed my life. That day really did change my life. Our volunteers generally start before daybreak. Our record is uh, well over 500 birds over a six hour period at just one structure. So every day holds a surprise. We really don't know what to expect. The line of the breastbone is down the middle and you can feel on either side how much meat there is and he was in very good shape. Nice and fat, solid. He's got broken legs but that would have happened when he hit. You don't realize how many there are <laughs> until you start emptying them out. It's uh, an emotional roller coaster. I've been doing this for 20 years now, and you think after 20 years you would kind of be void of the anger and, and sadness when you see this, but it never goes away. It, it, it's uh, just a constant reminder of how big of a problem it is. We're picking up a ton of Canada warblers. Which is a ton of Canada warblers? Yeah, well, a ton for us, and I think there's well over 20 so far. Oh, great. The species of concern. Yes. And. What about white throated sparrows? How are they doing? Uh, well, you know what? They came through early. Kingfisher, yeah, see the indigo see. buntings are yep. back making an appearance. Boy, these are beautiful birds. Mm. Oh, and the Orioles. I see more wood thrush here than I do in the woods these days. 